Hello everyone. Try these leftover rice recipes in three ways. Almost in every home we have this problem of leftover rice. Everyone love to have hot food but not cold. So try this and the paste here I have used is I have prepared for this colored idli. So check that recipe first. So all I have taken is a pan over here and added just 2 tablespoons of oil and this beetroot paste to it. I I have told you I have prepared colored idli so I have prepared that paste so even this paste is with me. So I just want to show you simple recipes with this. Now add salt, half a tablespoon chili, pinch of turmeric, pinch ginger garlic paste and pinch jeera powder or cumin powder and just give a nice stir till the oil oozes out of the beetroot paste and add just 1 cup of the leftover rice and give a nice stir till the beetroot color uh, gets over all the rice see like this now just garnish with some coriander leaves and some mint leaves and that's it your beetroot rice is ready no chilies no onions nothing just go with this rice everybody will love it now on the other hand take a pan and again add just two tablespoons of oil and the carrot puree give it a nice stir and then add same as the beetroot rice salt chili powder ginger garlic paste and cumin powder and turmeric now add a cup of rice and give it a nice stir till the color comes to orange like this and then garnish with mint leaves and coriander leaves and put it aside now on the other hand take a pan and add 2 tablespoons of oil and add chopped capsicum green peas and half a tomato chopped let it cook for 3 minutes and then see after nice salt add salt add ginger garlic paste and add cumin powder here i didn't add turmeric or chili powder okay because i want that whitish color with this green peas so add 1 cup of rice and give it a nice stir and that's it garnish with mint leaves and coriander leaves our three ways of rice with the leftover is ready so isn't it very easy so for these purees beetroot and carrot please go check the link below i have given which i have prepared for the colored idlis so i have those purees ready so you can just go and check out how i have prepared the purees also so isn't this delicious and yummy your kids truly will love it and you can just give it for their lunch boxes also so give it a try and let me know how it turned to you see how yummy it is and how colorful it is see when you cook it with love you know everybody will love it so let me know bye bye